Stone Conference, Jeff Gunlock, you know I like this call. He wants to go yes. long oil and gas. <laughs> he wants to short Facebook. This, to me, is the quintessential problem in the market. Because if you want to change leadership from Fang and big tech, that's literally what you have to do. You awesome. have to sell Fang, and you have to go buy cyclicals. And it's really your dream call. <laughs> you know, well, I, guess, I have no know, horse in this race. I was going to say, that, that <laughs> didn't sound stuff. objective to but, me. But, <laughs> but part of this, when you read what Jeff Gunlock had to say, it was really kind of personal about Zuckerberg. It was. He was under-impressed by that testimony in front of the Senate. Yeah, and he's just the latest in a long line of people who've come out sort of swinging against Facebook, against Zuckerberg. The really interesting one to me was Larry, Larry Robbins of Glenview, who kind of did it. It's, it's a very sort of counter-narrative uh, counter out there. So he said he was long the likes of McKesson, CVS, Express Scripts, because he says he thinks that Amazon will not get into the pharmacy benefits business. He thinks there's too much regulatory risk there. And so he actually sees his businesses as having moats around them. So these are real businesses, right? Let's talk about something else, Bitcoin. Yeah. <laughs> My favorite one, we have Mr. Pfeffer saying Bitcoin's going to go to $700,000. I mean, how do you even, like, do the <laughs> yeah. modeling for it's, that? It's going to replace gold, he says. Like, what, it's going to replace gold. gold. It's, the, uh, it's the only long-term <laughs> serious replacement for gold, he said, right, which... Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know. I didn't even I've know what we were looking for. <laughs> That's right, day. exactly. Uh, but uh, what, what's interesting, too, is how well these guys actually perform. So they come out, they make yeah. these calls, the market moves, yada, yada. But then if you walk it forward, a lot of these calls have not panned out for these guys. Uh, yeah, I would say that's a broad Somehow. trend across hedge funds, right? They make a lot of calls that don't necessarily pan out. We see that with the activists. We see that with the merger arbs. Um, and look, some of these calls are obviously smart. So I think Grubhub was one that was mentioned. And Grubhub yes, obviously has mm -hmm. had a, a, a sort of knockout year already. And there seems to be this trend of, um, you know, more people using that kind of online service to access food.